Welcome to the Toyota Football for Tomorrow training tips. Let's get started. Toyota Football for Tomorrow empowers youth with skills in football and beyond to enjoy the thrill and joy of moving together and to believe in the possibilities of tomorrow. This is inspired by Toyota's vision to provide the freedom of mobility to all. This video series will feature renowned coaches and former Japanese national football players from Nagoya Grampus, a football club founded by Toyota back in 1939 and is now one of the top J-League football clubs in Japan. Over the years, Toyota has worked with Nagoya Grampus to conduct youth football clinics in Southeast Asia and looks forward to spreading the joy of football through these virtual football lessons. By bringing the program online, we hope to bring the thrill and joy from the stadiums to our homes. Hello everyone, my name is Motohiro Yamaguchi. I supervise the football operations for Nagoya Grampus Football Club. Today, I will be introducing drills to practice turns, which is an important part of football. Being able to turn smoothly and effectively with the ball is important. Let's give it a try. As you can see, the move is a little bit difficult. But imagine you are receiving the ball from the back and you want to turn with it to move forward. The key is to keep the turn tight. In order to keep the turn tight, it is important to control the ball well and maintain good footwork. Pay close attention to the steps in the turn. Let's have another look. Okay, that was great. Now let's see what happens when you don't have good control over the ball and it requires you to make a bigger turn. When you make a bigger turn, it takes more time. Let's have a look. As you can see, that was a bad turn. Because the ball was not controlled properly, he had to step back before making the turn. Make sure you maintain good control of the ball and turn on the spot. Show us a couple more. Turn right over the ball. This drill is a little more complicated than the previous one. Get a friend to stand behind you and signal which direction you should run to after you turn. If there is no signal, run forward. This drill is good because when you concentrate too much on practicing your turn, you tend to drop your head and lose sight of what's around you. This training is designed to stop that from happening. Let's try again. As you can see, he looks back before receiving the ball. Since you are receiving the ball from the back and you want to turn to move forward, it is important to look behind you first before you turn. You want to know where the defender is and which way to go before you turn.
This drill is even more difficult. Have your friend play as a defender. The defender will choose to press to your right, left or directly behind you. Control the ball slightly in front of you before you turn to create space between you and the defender. As you turn, check the defender's position and move the ball in the other direction. Let's have another look. If you are not aware of how much space there is around you, the defender can easily close in on you and steal the ball. Make sure you have enough space by moving the ball slightly in front of you before turning. This will allow you to avoid the defender's press. This concludes our training on how to turn. As you can see, turning is not as easy as it sounds. Since football is a sport that requires you to push forward towards the opponent's goal, turning is essential. The next time you play, think about how you turn, and that will open up many more interesting options for you.